Alrighty, everyone, welcome back to another video. Uh, my apologies. So here's the thing that happened, right? We just finished up uh, chapter 7X, the bonus chapter, last night. Came back. Uh, I was playing this level here. Um, made it all the way through the end and saved. Um, but because we ran into a little bit of an issue with the charging cable, um, Basically, it automatically cut the, the video. So I only had half the video for you here. So it just seemed kind of stupid to do it that way. So what I've decided instead, look, you're going to see some gameplay uh, in the background. Just kind of how the level went thus far. Uh, and I can explain a little bit to do with the storyline for you. So this one was pretty basic. Really, we weren't missing out on a ton. Uh, they introduced the ballistae in this level, so it's like a very, very long range uh, bow. It has five arrows to it, um, so really it, it didn't do that much. Maybe you'll be able to see some of it in the gameplay here. Um, it wasn't a huge threat, right? Later in the game, it might be a threat, but a lot of the dialogue even was based around the fact that in this mission... Uh, or in this chapter, we were going to have enemies with ballistae. So that's a big portion of it. The other portion of it, of course, was just going into the fact that these are actually Kalean soldiers now. So Lugrid has really gone to another level now. We're not just fighting thugs. We are actually fighting other Kalean soldiers. And Kent uh, references to at some point. He actually knew some of them. So we don't get any special dialogues based off of that, but uh, it was kind of cool. To, uh, to see that reference so that in large part is what happened oh I should say as well both Nils and Ninian uh, sensed the ballista before it actually happened so that was that was interesting as well just kind of some proof to the claims that they've been saying how they can actually uh, foresee danger I mean none of our characters were skeptical Lynn just believed it right off the bat which is Kind of crazy considering everything that's happened. But look, now we have proof, right? So we're in a good spot. Uh, Will says he's able to use the ballista as well. So that, once again, is just a hint for you. that you can go use the ballista with your archers anytime. But Wrath doesn't say anything. So don't think that you can just go on them with, um, with any horse unit, really. You can't, right? You should be a, a straight-up archer. Um, outside of that, there was one village. In that village, you get a weapon that's called a Lance Eaver. And it's a sword that reverses the weapon triangle. So you can actually beat a lance with it, even though it's a sword. But then axes tend to be good at that. So that was an interesting thing to learn. Um, now, we were going to learn about these kind of weapons later on anyway. Because the, box, the boss sorry, has an axe lever. Uh, and so you can imagine what it does the opposite right it's a lance that beats an axe so then we ended up coming through uh, and I killed the boss with Urk so in the next mission you'll see he's fairly leveled up so we have um, Sane and Kent both at level 8 we have Lin at level 7 Dorcas was level 5 coming up on 6 and we got um, Urk up to level 6 as well so it was pretty fantastic. It was a good way to kind of round out our team. I'm really psyched, actually, on the little team we have going here. Sane, Kent, Urk, Lynn, Dorcas. I like those guys. I want to make sure that we're using them more going forward. Anyway, this chapter ends with them saying, okay, you know what? We need to get to Lynn's grandfather as fast as possible. So that's what we're going to focus on doing. We're going to go back to Catholic. So the next chapter, which should be chapter 9... That's exactly what we're going to see. We're going to be heading back to Catholic. Anyway, that's a pretty brief summary. You're able to get what would have been... Uh, it was going to be like 25 minutes, actually closer to a half hour. Uh, and now you're able to get that content in like five minutes. So this could be a really good thing. And maybe you like the format, actually. Maybe it's a good test. Could be a really bad thing, in which case you can complain about it in the comments. And I will hear you. And I will go back. And I'll play the whole game through, try to emulate the exact same thing, just to get back to Chapter 8. Just to do it right, if it's what you really want, right? So this channel is all about the people, right? This series here, we're just having some fun with it. But if you fight...
to C Chapter 8, then I promise you, okay, I'm going to deliver that. Um, but anyway, for now, we're just having some fun with it, right? So thank you so much for coming. Thank you for watching this anyway. Um, and just for all the support for the channel so far, you are awesome. And I hope that you have a fantastic evening. All right. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.